next to managing risk through knowledgeable, competent persons and a comprehensive rigging plan. Knowing the condition and capabilities of your rigging gear is the most important factor to safe lifting. Let's identify the many components that go into proper rigging equipment. The most common piece of rigging gear found in the offshore work environment is the wire rope sling. A braided or planted sling, due to its construction, is often selected where loads must be rolled or maneuvered, since the design creates friction and a gripping effect, which reduces load slippage and rotation. Always make sure the hook is clearly identified with size and manufacturer, and is suitable for lifting. The shackle, if properly applied, is one of the most secure means of attaching rigging to a load. Make sure the shackles you use are clearly marked with the working load limit and the manufacturer and are suitable for overhead lifting. You may often encounter loads that have painted surfaces or fine instrumentation that wire rope slings could damage. In those cases, the use of synthetic web slings has many advantages. Another type of rigging component is the spreader bar. Spreader bars help reduce the chance of tipping or sliding and help prevent low sling angles and the tendency of the slings to crush the load. No matter what type of rigging you are using, it is vital that you know the capacity of all rigging components and be sure that they are inspected on a daily basis.